My name is Rachel. I live in Haiti. I haven't been able to leave my house for weeks because everything has become so dangerous. I fear for my life. A long-lasting human rights and humanitarian crisis has forced thousands of Asians to flee our homes. Many of us left years ago and are still trying to find a safe home across the Americas, where countries are failing to uphold our rights and to protect us against racial discrimination. Our journeys force us to pass through different countries, where we are confronted with racism, discrimination and even violence. Once we arrive at the U.S.-Mexico border, we are often denied asylum and detained in inhumane conditions. Marjorie and her husband lived there. They did not treat people from other countries in this way. People from other places were allowed to talk to their families. They were brought to the hospital when they were sick. But Haitians did not find the same treatment. When Haitians are detained, we are frequently not treated as people. Families are separated. They are not allowed proper access to food and health care. Most of us, including pregnant women and breastfeeding women, are chained, a practice which amounts to torture. Take action for me and my community. Your voice counts. Urge the United States government to stop expulsions and deportations to Haiti, restore access to asylum, document and investigate anti-black discrimination and torture and other ill treatment at the border. Join us to take care of those we love. We want to keep dreaming. Together, we can make our hope a reality.